Hello students, we are going to discuss worksheet 31 for the date 14th September. Now in this worksheet as our chapter life process was going on and in the last worksheet we have completed the fourth life process that is excretion. Now we are going to discuss some expected questions from this chapter for objective type short answers and long answers. So let's start. If you find difficulty in any question you can see previous videos from that to clarify your doubts. First is organally used as the site of photosynthesis. So it is because chloroplast is the organelle which is present in the plants only. State the role of enzyme trypsin in process of digestion. Remember this trypsin is released by organ called pancreas and this trypsin help in the complete digestion of protein you can write because it is an ob objective type question you have to write in one mark only then you write trypsin help in the complete digestion of protein in small intestine this much may be enough for this third is how is ATP built during respiration so this is again a one mark question so ATP adenosine triphosphate is built in the mitochondria or cell organelle by the respiration process the energy released during the respiration process in this ADP that is adenosine diphosphate combines with the phosphate group. So you can write that equation also that ADP plus PI then the energy which is released through the respiration you can show it here and then you can write ATP. So this can be shown like this also. Okay. Fourth is anaerobic respiration occurs in yeast, bacteria, human muscle cells. It, the answer is all of the above. The functional unit of excretory system is nephron. The blood cells which are helpful in stopping the blood at the site of injury is platelets. Then the complete the sentence. Lymph is similar to plasma. Okay, You have to write plasma, the liquid part of the blood. and But it is colorless. Here you write colorless and contains less number of protein okay what happens to a plant if xylem is removed if xylem is removed plant will not get the water and required minerals and plant will not be able to perform photosynthesis the blood vessel which bring oxygenated blood from the lungs into the heart remember here the exceptional case is there generally vein is taking the deoxygenated blood but here the vein is doing this job so it is pulmonary vein. Stomata are tiny pores present on the surface of the leaves and second is gaseous exchange takes place in plants through these stomata. So both are true and R is the correct explanation of the A. Next see the short answer type question. Why does a piece of bread start tasting sweeter after chewing for some time? So remember that what kind of enzyme is released in the mouth it is amylase and the work of amylase is to break down the carbohydrate so bread is having a carbohydrate in it when we chew it the amylase get mixed it with it and the polysaccharide sugar that is carbohydrate is broken down to the disaccharide form and that's why we feel the sweeting taste if we uh, eat roti for more if we chew roti for more amount of time or you can say rice we will feel the same taste which is the largest gland in human digestive system and what is its function its liver and liver function is that first thing it is storing the extra carbohydrate in the form of glycogen second it is releasing the bile juice which is helping two ways first you have to write it help in the changing of medium of the food which is coming from stomach and going to smaller stand to a basic medium and second it is helping in breaking down of the large fat globules into the small fat globules so you can write these two functions these three events that occur during the process of photosynthesis so remember these three events you have to write in a proper sequence way first was absorption of sunlight with the help of chlorophyll pigment second breaking down or you can write the photolysis of water and third is the reduction process, the com combination of hydrogen with the carbon dioxide to give you glucose. Fourth question state the function of villi. So villi is what? These are the finger like projections present in the small intestine and they are helping in the absorption of digested food and sending this digested food to the different parts of the body. So remember this function. 
Stomata of desert plants remain closed during the day. Explain how when they take carbon dioxide. Very interesting question it is. The stomata in case of desert plants remains closed during the daytime because of if they opens then higher rate of transpiration will uh, uh, result in the loss of excess of water. So they remain closed during day. In the night when they open they take the carbon dioxide and convert it to the malic acid. So they store this carbon dioxide which is absorbed in the night in the form of malic acid and the, in the daytime when the process of photosynthesis occur they utilize this malic acid and convert it into the carbohydrate. So this is how this reaction or process takes place of in case of the desert plants. Now in this flow chart gastric glands present in the wall of stomach what the three things which they are releasing you have to write first HCl then mucus and and the pepsin so the function of HCl is there are two function you have to write it will kill the germs in the food which are coming through the food and second it will make the environment acidic which will be helpful for this pepsin enzyme or you can say it help in the activation of pepsin enzyme mucus which is present is help the inner lining of your stomach wall from this HCl. So this mucus protect the inner lining of your stomach from HCl and pepsin help in the digestion of protein. So the digestion of protein starts in the stomach. What is meant by double circulation in human beings? When we say double circulation, if you remember that the your human heart diagram, there are two cycles which are go going in the human body one is from heart to lungs and another is from heart to body parts so these two cycles combinedly make the, it a double circulation and the upper cycle is known as pulmonary circulation and the lower cycle is known as systematic circulation so you have to write the meaning of both the when the blood is going from your right ventricle to the lungs and coming back from lungs to the left auricle this complete cycle is known as pulmonary circulation and when it is going from the left ventricle to the body organs and from body organs to the right auricle it is known as systematic circulation and this combined makes a it double circulation differentiate between arteries and veins so arteries and veins first arteries are deeply seated veins are superficial arteries are pink in color veins are green in color arteries are thick walled veins are thin walled Arteries do not have valves, veins have valves. So many difference you can write. How do transpiration help in upward transport of sus substances? So this transpiration creates a upward pressure because when the transpiration is occurring, if this is the xylem tube and here the water which is present, it by the process of sunlight, uh, because of the heat of the sunlight rises up in the form of vapor th so that this space becomes empty. So the water which is present here in the roots will rise by the concentration gradient from the higher pressure to the lower pressure. So this is how the transpiration is helping. Explain the process of urine formation in case of kidney, human kidney. You have to write the functioning of nephron here, complete functioning you can write. Then the long answer questions, draw a sectional view of human heart and label on it. So you have to write a sectional view that means you have to cut upper vertical view half heart then you can show all these things in that second is justify the statement that blood circulation phase is different from the blood circulation in human beings so first point you have to remember in this case is the blood circulation in case of human beings is different because the heart is four chambered in case of human beings and it is two chambered in case of fishes first point second in case of fishes the oxygenated blood directly goes into the body organs without going inside the heart back like in human heart it goes back into the heart then it is pumped to the body organs so in case of fishes it is directly going to the body organs instead of going to the heart in case of human beings the blood as at higher pressure is required so that it can reach fastly to each and every cell whereas in case of fishes it is not happening like that Second is draw a label diagram of human excretory system. In the last worksheet we have done, you can easily draw a excretory system diagram. Write one function each of label parts. You can write kidney, ureter, urinary bladder and urethra. Kidney for filtration, ureteri transferring this filter, 
uh, urine from the kidneys to the bladder bladder is the storage organ and urethra is the organ which is throwing out the urine third is the there is difference in the rate of breathing in case of aquatic organism and terrestrial organism why explain this was a question in the last worksheet also when we talk of aquatic organism aquatic organism breathes at a faster rate as compared to terrestrial organism because the amount of oxygen which is present in water is very less as compared to the amount of oxygen which is present in case of air for the terrestrial organism so to complete the demand of the oxygen the aquatic organisms have to breathe at a faster rate so that they get the desired amount of oxygen from the water while terrestrial organism are already having enough amount of oxygen present in air that is 21 percent so they don't have to breathe at a faster rate okay so you have to remember that the amount of oxygen present in water is very very less as compared to the amount of water oxygen present in the air for the terrestrial organism hope you like this work this worksheet explanation as it is a question answers based so it is not possible to write all the answers but you can see the previous video if you find any kind of difficulty thanks for watching do like share and comment